Good evening, everyone. I'm Chris Whaley, and it is my very distinct pleasure to welcome you to Roan State Community College's annual awards night. Awards night has been an important part of the college since 1971, and that's the year that the institution first opened. This is an evening and an event that we are very excited about every single year as we honor the best and the brightest of our student body for the 2020-2021 academic year, we are also marking the official start of the countdown to another successful year, albeit a bit different uh, for several different obvious reasons. I offer my congratulations sincerely to all of our honorees for your excellent, excellent work. We are so proud of our students here at Roan State Community College. The faculty mentor pen, the pen's diamond design symbolizes both the impeccable quality of your teaching and the priceless bond between student and teacher. The pen is meant to be worn with academic regalia as a mark of your teaching excellence, although you are certainly welcome to proudly wear your pen anytime. I am Dr. Myra Peebyhouse and I serve as Dean of the Humanities Division. I am pleased to present the following awards. Congratulations to this year's Art Award recipient, Alex Dahl of Oak Ridge. Hosami Quintana of Knoxville is this year's award recipient in the Writing Learning Support category. This year's award recipient in the Research category is Kyle Reed of Grandview. He would like to recognize Professor Deanna Stevens. Kayla Rector of Crossville is this year's recipient of the Beulah Davis Outstanding Freshman Writer Award in the Narrative category. Matthew Harvey of Crossville is this year's award-winning writer in the literary analysis category. He would like to recognize Professor Deanna Stevens. This year's recipient of the Outstanding Musician Award is Bethany Brock of Sunbright. She would like to recognize Professor Chris Metcalf. Congratulations to Siobhan Curdy of Knoxville, this year's Spanish Award recipient. Carissa Pilkey of 10 Mile is this year's Outstanding Actor. Congratulations to Carissa Pilkey, this year's Humanities Award recipient. She would like to recognize Dr. Matt Waters. I'm Dan Heider, Interim Dean of Social Science, Business, and Education. It's my privilege to announce the following awards from our division. The first award is the Outstanding Criminal Justice Student. And the student, the winner this year is Kelly Johnson and she wanted to recognize one of her faculty, Elizabeth Lewis, with a faculty pen. The second award is the AAUW Education Award. That's the American Association of University of Women. And the winner of the award this year is Katie Cooper. The next award, we have two winners. It's the Rome State Community College Education Award. The first winner is Mary Iverson, and she wanted to recognize Cody Miller with a faculty pen. And the other winner is Chase Terry. The next award is the Environmental Health Technology Student of the Year Award. This year, the award uh, winner is Nikki Woods. And Nikki wanted to recognize Dan Hyder for a faculty pen. That's me. I appreciate it, Nikki. The next award is the Academic Excellence in Geospatial Studies Award. The winner is Alex Camudi. Alex wanted to recognize Mark Young with the faculty pen. The winner of the Outstanding Geographic Information Systems Student Award is Jordan Stevens. The next award is the Polk Cooley Pioneer of Law Paralegal Studies Outstanding Student. Many of us in Roan County knew Polk Cooley. He was a longtime lawyer in Rockwood, kind of an institution in Roan County in East Tennessee. And I had uh, the privilege to speak to him just uh, shortly before he passed away a little over a year ago. But the winner of the, that award is Cynthia Ryan, and she wanted to recognize Tracy Williams with a faculty pen. The next award is the Contemporary Management Award. And the winner this year is Jeannie Laws. The next award is Outstanding Accounting Student. And the winner of that award is Jared White. The Excellent in Business Award this year goes to Benjamin Cantrell. The award is the Krista McAuliffe Education Award. The award this year goes to Jamie Coulter and to Earl Davis. I'm Patricia Jenkins, and it's my privilege to serve as the Dean of Health Sciences at Rome State Community College. 
I'm honored to recognize the award recipients for the nine student awards in the Health Science Division. The first award for nursing is the Christine Mills Award. The recipient of that award is Marion Williford. The next award in nursing is the June Bilbrey Award. The recipient of the June Bilbrey Nursing Award is Carla Franklin. The third award in nursing is the Nursing Merit Award. The recipient is Rachel Davies. The fourth nursing award is the Tennessee Nurses Association Leadership Award. The recipient of that award is Melissa Webb. The next award is for the OTA program and is the Heck Award for Innovation and Creativity in Design. The recipient of the Heck Award is Joshua Palmer. The second OTA award is the McFadden Occupational Therapy Assistant Alliance Award. The recipient is Tanya Arkoshenko. The third OTA award is the Fatih OTA Student Award, and the recipient is Amanda Gilbert. The next award is for the Outstanding Health Information Technology Student Award. The recipient is Angela Fowler. The last award for the Health Science Division is the Opticianry Student of the Year Award. The recipient of this award is Suni Montesino. Hi, I'm Bruce Cantrell. I'm the Interim Dean of the Mathematics and Sciences Academic Division. The first awards will be Anatomy and Physiology. There are two Anatomy and Physiology awards. The first award goes to Johnny Wilson. Johnny Wilson would like to recognize Mary Ann Sexton. The second Anatomy and Physiology Award goes to Jessica Lynn Mann. The next awards are the Biology Awards. There are three Biology Awards. The first award goes to Kennedy Irwin. Kennedy would like to recognize Dr. Ashley Galloway. The second award goes to Shabray Eskridge. Uh, Shabray would also like to recognize Dr. Ashley Galloway. The third biology award goes to Donovan Willits. The next award is for excellence in mechatronics. This award goes to Daniel Fleming. Uh, Daniel would like to recognize Galarami Garcia. The next award is the Outstanding Geology Award. This award goes to Harley Whalen. Uh, Harley would like to recognize Dr. Arthur Lee. The Freshman Math Award goes to Dusty Prater. Dusty would like to recognize Claudia Cummings. The Sophomore Math Award goes to Julian Sanocencio. The Calculus-Based Physics Award goes to Sydney Campbell. Sydney would like to recognize Steve Ward. The Organic Chemistry Award also goes to Sydney Campbell. We have four chemistry awards. The Chemistry Award for Roan County Campus goes to Allie Moore. The Chemistry Award for Cumberland County goes to Juliana Allie. The Oak Ridge Chemistry Award goes to Kara Darley. Kara would like to recognize Dr. Sylvia Pastor. Uh, the Chemistry Award for Scott County goes to Lauren Hennington. The next award is the Programming Award. It goes to Journey Long. Journey would like to recognize Dr. George McGobgob. The Database Award also goes to Journey Long. The Cyber Defense Award goes to Zach Garad. Zach would also like to recognize Dr. George McGobgob. And finally, the Engineering Award goes to Julian Sanocencio. Hello, I am Dr. Diane Ward, Vice President for Student Learning and Chief Academic Officer. I'm proud to announce the following award recipients. The All-Tennessee Academic Team, 
Deborah Porter and Dusty Prater. And both of these students would like to recognize Claudia Cummings. The 4.0 Academic Achievement Awards, Carly Anderson, Aiden Atkin, Savannah Blankenship, Autumn Bowling, Taylor Brantley, and Taylor would like to recognize Dr. Julie Hall, Sydney Campbell, and Sydney would like to recognize Steve Ward, Shelby Chitwood, Harley Daniels, Autumn Edwards, and Autumn would like to recognize Ann Morphew, Daniel Fleming, and Daniel would like to recognize Guillerme Garcia, Isabella Googe, and Isabella would like to recognize Andrea King, April Hamilton, Micah Holmes, and Micah would like to recognize Steve Ward, Mary Iverson, and Mary would like to recognize Dr. Cody Miller, Henry Kitts, Journey Long, and Journey would like to recognize Dr. George McGobgob, Peyton Mason, Anna Meadows, Melissa Munial, Monica Norton, and Monica would like to recognize Gloria Drake, Kristen Uten, and Kristen would like to recognize Stella Gomez de Campo, Kaylee Peters, and Kaylee would like to recognize Elizabeth Genevieve's, Ivy Queen, Corey Smith, Alexis Smith, and Alexis would like to recognize Steve Ward, Jacob Standifer, Jamie Stevens, Janet Thomas, and Janet would like to recognize Dr. Arthur Lee, Sydney Walter, and Sydney would like to recognize Maggie Bolden, McKaylee Willis, and Garrett Wright. The Athletic Awards, Baseball Academic Award, Brandon Langenberg. The Men's Basketball Academic Award, Jacob Naylor. The Women's Basketball Academic Award, Chloe Rourke. The Golf Academic Award, Brandon Jordan. The Softball Academic Award, Lauren Lawson. And Lauren would like to recognize Steve Ward. The Volleyball Academic Award, Jadlyn Herman. The Cab SGA Award, Eli Anderson. And Eli would like to recognize Dr. John Brown. The Learning Center Awards, the Learning Center Tutor Award for Cumberland, Amy Lawrence. The Learning Center Tutor Award for Harriman, Chase Mitchell. The Learning Center Tutor Award for Oak Ridge, Dusty Prater. And Dusty would like to recognize Claudia Cummings. The Jennifer Jordan Henry Learning Center Award, Amy Lawrence. The Middle College Student of the Year Award, Shabray Eskridge. Shabray would like to recognize Dr. Ashley Galloway. The Roan State Foundation Ambassador Award, Jacob Naylor. The Roan State Service Learning Award, Tanya Arkashenko. I would now like to move on to our two most prestigious student awards. First, I would like to introduce you to the nominees for the Roan State Community College Outstanding Freshman Award. The nominees are Sydney Smith, Mabel Johnson, Emily Barnes, Kara Wyatt. Students are nominated for this award by faculty and staff and, award, and an awards committee deliberates and makes a very difficult final selection. The award winner nominees must be full-time freshmen with at least a 3.5 grade point average or higher. There is also an emphasis on school and community activities. And again, every single one of these nominees is an outstanding freshman. 
and an outstanding representative of her own state. So now with great pride, the recipient of the 2021 Outstanding Freshman Award is Mabel Johnson. Congratulations, Mabel. And to all the nominees, congratulations on a job well done. We are so proud of you. Each year, students are nominated for the President's Award by faculty and staff at Roan State Community College. Nominees must be full-time graduating sophomore students who have earned at least 36 hours by the end of the spring semester with a grade point average of at least 3.5. 27 of those hours must have been earned at Roan State Community College. Once again, there is an emphasis placed on each nominee's school and community activities. We're proud to say the recipient of the President's Award will also receive a $1,500 cash award. Year after year, those of us on the selection committee talk about just how difficult it is to make a decision, and we really mean that. We have the distinct honor, you see, of talking with the very best, the very brightest graduating sophomores at Roan State Community College. And so it's always a tough decision. This year was no exception. We didn't have a single student who was less than outstanding this year and who was very, very deserving. We always say that being nominated for the President's Award is in and of itself an honor, and that's very true. This year, the stories these students shared with us could fill a ceremony of their own. And it's an honor for each one of us on the committee to get to meet with them, to hear them. And it's an honor that each and every one of them represents Rome State Community College so well. The nominees for the award serve as proof that our future is very bright. And with that, I would like to share the names of the President's Award nominees. Eli Anderson. Amanda Gilbert, Madison Lehman, Lauren Lawson, Carissa Pilkey, Dusty Prater, Nick Spardoni, Sydney Walter. Again, many congratulations to these nominees. And it's with great pride that I announce the winner of the 2021 President's Award is Madison Lehman. Congratulations, Madison, to all of our nominees. You make us so proud, and we are so honored to have you here at Run State Community College. Congratulations again to all of our recipients. This concludes our ceremony, and I'd like to thank Jennifer Fugate, Dr. Matt Waters, all the members of the Awards Night Committee for making this virtual celebration possible. For everyone who has helped make this evening possible in a virtual sense, thank you so much. Have a great evening, and again, many, many congratulations. <laughs>